which leads to my big announcement, which I'm so excited about. You guys might have noticed all the pink. Got some pink in the background, a little bit of pink over here. So I recently was thinking and I was like brainstorming. and welcome back to my youtube channel my name is kelly hi if you're new so this is the third episode of the kelly diaries and the kelly diaries is basically my vlog series so anytime i bring you guys along with me and it's a vlog it's part of the kelly diaries which i'm super excited about so i thought it would be fun to bring you guys along with me for a day in my life vlog even though it's already like three o'clock but i did film a morning routine this morning and that'll be up tomorrow so if you watch that you can kind of get like the first half of this video in a sense you know but I just thought I'd bring you guys along with me today because I got a package in the mail that I want to share with you guys plus I have something super exciting to share with you guys as well but I do have spin class tonight I missed my spin class this morning because I overslept which was like low-key like the best thing ever because I was so tired after Memorial Day weekend I was like staying up so late and been outside and everything so I was definitely much needed but I missed my morning spin class which Tuesday morning spin classes are my absolute favorite but it's okay I'm taking a spin class tonight so we're gonna go to that and then I also have some editing to do it's kind of like a chill day because i feel like summer is just still getting started i just feel like i don't have like a ton of summer plans yet but don't worry i'm gonna be vlogging a ton this summer and bringing you guys along with me which i'm super excited about but i thought i'd just get the vlog started now the morning routine is so cute you guys are gonna absolutely love it so if you're new definitely hit that subscribe button that way you can get notified when that is up i've been uploading my videos at 3 p.m still because that's what i did during the school year but now that it's summertime i'm like do you guys want to see them earlier I don't know let me know in the comments down below but i'm gonna go get that package and then we can open that up and i'll share it with you guys i'm super excited and also before i go leave my room to go get that package i thought i'd share my outfit with you guys it's so cute so i just have on this white peplon top it has like eyelet detailing on it and i got this from she in last summer and funny story it actually like shrunk in the wash so it's kind of tiny and like more cropped now but i think it's still super cute and it's so lightweight which is perfect for those really hot summer days and then i just threw on my pink gingham chinos which i am obsessed with these these are one of my first pair of chino shorts from j crew and i just love them and then i just have on my platinum jacks my nails are painted munchy munchy by ezzy i'm obsessed with the shade and i just have on my kate spade watch and my everyday rings it's so cute we are at my desk i just went and got the clothes they're seriously so adorable and i'm super excited to style them they are from shein so if you guys want to check them out i will have them linked down below for you guys so the first thing is this matching two-piece set and it is like pink and white stripes kind of reminds me of seersucker super cute so fun for summer so they have these little shorts they're kind of tiny i got this set in a size large and they fit perfectly but the thing is you can't pull them up too high like to make it so it's not super cropped because otherwise they'll be too short but they fit really nice they're really comfortable and they're like a nice cotton slash linen material so i feel like these are going to be perfect for the summer and then the top is just like this crop top and you tie it around your neck like this and then tie it around the middle it is very cropped a little bit more cropped than i'm used to but like i think it'll be perfect for summer especially for like the beach or the pool or just put it on top of your swimsuit so it's just a little cropped and i still have to tie it because again this is brand new i'm always like so sad when they have like cute bows tied on like on any website and then you get it and it's not tied in the same bow and i'm like i can't do that and then it just doesn't look the same but it's fine like i have a pair of seersucker shorts that are so cute and they have a big bow on them and i can just never tie the bow the same as the people did on the website and it's a struggle okay but so this is what the top looks like and then with the matching bottoms super cute i'm so excited to style this love the pink and then i did pick up another pink item and i actually have the same top but in neon green you guys know i'm obsessed with the neon trend going on lately and i saw this and i just like knew i needed to get it i feel like lily pulitzer actually has a similar top to this so it is this off the shoulder tank top it's got a big ruffle sleeve on it it's very simple on the bottom i got this in a size small i think i could honestly fit into an extra small because it is very loose but so it has this it's like off the shoulder very fun this color makes you look so tan and then the straps tie up like this which i just feel like it gives it a summer vibe too but honestly if you don't like having the necktie around it or 
or if you're like outside and you don't want to get like a, a tan line from it you could just easily tuck it into the shirt and just wear it like this so you could definitely style this a few different ways and I just think it's so cute and so fun and the perfect shade of pink because I am obsessed with the neons then I picked up a swimmy and I got this in a size medium and I wasn't sure because I read the size guide and the review said that it fit true to size I just tried it on and I think my torso is too long for it so I definitely need it to size up but it is a super cute yellow gingham swimsuit and it's just like has a little bow in the front so it has this cutout in the middle because it's a one piece and then it has a cutout on the back as well so it's kind of like an open back but what I really liked about it is it had more coverage on the bottom I feel like it's so hard to find a swimsuit this summer that has like a full or close to full coverage bottom just because it's so trendy not to which I'm okay with that but like considering I'm going on a family vacation I'm like mm, okay but so I'm kind of sad this one didn't fit but I think it's just because I had a longer torso I am 5'4 for some reference but I would probably recommend sizing up on this one I never really had any issues with their swimsuits before I think the quality is pretty good considering it's so inexpensive and I just thought this one was so cute but it did not fit and then the next thing I got is another pink item you guys I'm just like pink obsessed and it is this adorable tank top I got this in a size small it has a big ruffle detailing on it but I really love how it has the two different straps I thought that was really cool so it has this like thinner strap and then it just kind of like that ruffle look and then it's just like this baby pink color all the way down it's so cute so lightweight which I feel like is perfect for summer and it's just like this really soft material and I'm excited to style this I think the color is just so pretty and the last item is my personal favorite it's so stinking adorable and I got this in a size small and it is this white eyelet dress and it has these really adorable bell sleeves which I just feel like makes it look so girly and I love wearing eyelet during the summertime I just feel like it's one of my favorite summertime like materials to wear cute it's kind of like a little baby doll dress I did try this on and it fits pretty well considering it's a small and usually I wear mediums for dresses it's just a little short but I think if I would have sized up it would have been way too big around like my body but lengthwise it's a little short probably gonna wear shorts underneath this but it's so cute it's probably my new favorite summertime dress oh, I just love it so if you guys want to check out any of these pieces, I will have them linked down below along with the sizes that I picked in case you guys want to use me as a size reference. But super cute. Thank you so much, Chi-In, for sending that to me. And if you guys picked up on a little trend going on in that haul, which leads to my big announcement, which I'm so excited about, you guys might have noticed all the pink. Got some pink in the background little bit of pink over here so I recently was thinking and I was like brainstorm ideas like some video ideas Instagram content because you always have to be on your a-game I was like oh my goodness I had so much fun at the beginning of the year when I did my 45 days of pink when I did that from January to Valentine's Day which is February 14th so if you guys don't know what I'm talking about over on my Instagram which is just that Kelly Prepster I wore pink for 45 days straight it was so much fun because pink is my favorite color I was thinking about that I loved all those outfits it was really fun it made the winter go by so quickly because I was like oh it's another pink outfit day kind of thing it just brightened up my winter because usually I just wear a lot of neutrals in the winter and wearing pink every day just makes me so happy and then it was also really fun because it got you guys engaged as well because so many of you guys were sharing your hashtag 45 days of pink outfits on your stories on snapchat or just a picture and I would share it on my account and I was talking it over with like my mom and a few of my friends and they're like why don't you just do it again it was like the light bulb moment went off in my head and like I mentioned it was during the winter so a lot of the outfits were with like jeans and sweaters and it was just kind of more winter clothing and winter outfits which when they said why don't you do it again I was like well now it would be summertime outfits so that would be really fun so it's like shorts and t-shirts and tank tops and sandals basically long story short I'm going to be doing the 45 days of pink part two starting today Wednesday May 29th which I'm so excited about it's so much fun and I already have like a few pictures taken for my Instagram feed so definitely check me out on Instagram if you guys haven't already and if you guys want to participate like I mentioned the first time you don't have to do all 45 days if you just want to wear pink one day or if you find yourself wearing it take a picture tag me on Instagram um, if you put it on your story make sure you like add me in your story so I can repost it on my story I'm gonna have a little highlight reel on my Instagram of your pink outfit which I think is so much fun because I get so inspired by you guys and I feel like you guys don't even realize that but you guys inspire me so much and you guys always have the cutest outfit guys but also be sharing my pink outfits because 
your girl has a lot of pink clothes and a lot of summertime clothes especially for the pink so I thought it'd just be perfect I'm super excited I've been like keeping this a secret from you guys for like I want to say like two maybe three weeks now and I'm just like so excited I can finally talk about it so definitely give this video a big thumbs up if you guys are excited as well and tag me on Instagram use the hashtag 45 days of pink it's gonna be so much fun you guys can snapchat me outfits as well I'm just so excited. It's going to be so much fun and it's just like such a fun way to kickstart summer. So basically this will be going from June to like July, maybe August. I'm not really sure because I do have a beach vacation in between where I'm like, I don't know if I'm going to do pink there. It might be like a little vacation week off, but who knows? We'll see how it goes. I'm super excited and I just thought I would share that with you guys. But now I need to get editing a video. I think I have a video every day this week, which I'm so like shook because I've been uploading like two, maybe three videos a week and now we're like almost at every day again do you guys remember when I did everyday videos that was so much fun okay but I'm gonna get editing I have spin tonight and I'll keep you guys updated but I'm super excited for 45 days of pink part two it's gonna be so much fun hey guys so I just got dressed for spin and I just thought I would wear a pink top since I just told you guys about the 45 days of pink which I'm so excited about this is from lululemon I am obsessed I recently got it in a haul in case you guys want to check it out I will insert a card and then I just put on some of my favorite Nike leggings they're so cute and I just have on some Nike sneakers because I use like the little cages I don't like have spin shoes and it's just so nice because you can wear whatever shoes and I just thought these matched the outfit really well so we're gonna head over to the gym and get our workout done in a while and I just realized I forgot to take my makeup off so this will be very interesting so I hope my skin doesn't freak out but you know we're gonna go to the gym looking glam that's a win it is currently 6 15 and I was hoping to get there at 6 15 it starts at 6 30 so I'll be fine because I don't live that far away from my gym and everything but I was hoping to get there early so I can get like a little footage for you guys, but we'll see how it goes. And I'm just gonna jam out. I'm listening to my summer 2019 playlist. It is beautiful outside. It's 91 degrees and it's sunny. It just makes me so happy how nice it is outside. And yeah, I can't believe I forgot to take my makeup off. That was like my one thing I had to remember to do, but it's all good. It's all good. And I just love this tank top. I feel like it's such a happy color being pink. Low-key, like, vlogging in the car is, like, fine, but when you're stopped at a red light, it just gets so awkward, especially if there's, like, people right next to you because then they just stare at you. This little kid like, watching me, so it's all good. It's a green light now, but I'm going to put my favorite song on because there's this new song that I added to my playlist. It's, like, a country song, and I think it's new. So that song is called Make Me Want To by Jimmy Allen. I think it's Jimmy. Yeah, Jimmy Allen. Oh my god, you guys, it's so catchy and it's just so cute. I can't stop listening to it. But now I'm just going to put my thing on shuffle and we're almost like we're halfway to the gym now. I keep getting stuck at these awkward red lights where there's so many cars around me, you guys. It's making me very uncomfortable. <laughs> this song comes on at spin all the time and it's so funny. It's Snoop Dogg. how busy the gym is at the evening and it's so hard to find a parking spot like a good parking spot you guys but we made it here oh the pool's open okay exciting we're here safe and sound we did it I had to spin yesterday and I took a week off prior like a week like a few weeks ago and I haven't been able to do what I used to do like I used to do like 20 miles easily in an hour yesterday I finally got up to 18 so baby steps. Okay guys, I 
just finished thin. I'm on the way home. I got 18 miles in, which was crazy awesome. It was such a fun class. <sighs> I loved it. It was really a struggle with makeup on my face. I'm not gonna lie, because it was like, I couldn't wipe my face off and it was just it was a hot mess. But I'm on my way home now. I'm just gonna jam out and I'll update you guys then. Club going up on the Tuesday. So I just got home and I made some Purpel flavored water. It is so good. I did the pink one, like the pink box. I think it's berry, but it's really good. It has electrolytes in it, so it's really good for you after you do a workout. It just helps replenish and hydrate your body, which I think is awesome. But again, since I'm only drinking water, flavored water is so nice. It's kind of like a little refreshing treat. So I'm going to drink this, and then I'm going to go hop in the shower because we're going to have dinner soon, and we have dinner as a family. So I'm going to be ending the vlog here just because I'm going to set this down. Just because I feel like I'm not going to get any more clips for you guys because I'm probably just going to shower, eat dinner, and go to bed. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you guys did. I had so much fun bringing you guys along with me today. And tomorrow I'm going to be uploading a morning routine. So definitely check that out because that's like technically the first half of this video in case you want it all full day since I started this month. This one like in the afternoon. But I'm so excited for the 45 Days of Pink Part 2. It's going to be so much fun. Definitely use the hashtag 45 Days of Pink. Share your outfits on stories or post it on Instagram. I'm going to be sharing them on my Instagram as well, which is just that Kelly Prepster. I'm so excited. It's going to be so much fun. You guys know pink's my favorite color and it's just going to be such a fun way to kick start the summer so if you guys are as excited as i am and i hope you're having a wonderful day i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys very soon with my next one bye guys